Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to EU4. So, um, yeah, um, if you're wondering why I'm starting it for, um, it's an extraordinary situation. The Ottomans are at war, they are invading for Presporok. I've already invaded, finished off what I want from Poland. As you can see, the border is ready. This is the border region between me and the Holy Roman Empire. Empire until the day I can dissolve it. So until that day comes, this is what I get. Stettin. Okay. Now. Um. It's not going great. I need to make sure that these win because I'm um, independent. Poland is a lot, uh, Lithuania is a lot better than, um, than the PLC because PLC is going to be a lot stronger now. Here's revanchism. So, <laughs> oh god, <laughs> plus six sword unit. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, that's hilarious. Um, all in all, um, he's on tech 10, I'm on tech 11. Not perfect, but I think... Uh, what's... Dirt Wolf's block. Let's see if I can... I need him to get into a flatter terrain just to be safe. I don't want to lose too many men on this. Those, if these guys win, that means um, Lithuania goes independent, which is brilliant. Um, so I declare this war because um, I cannot allow the Ottomans, because it, it's the Ottomans. You never know if they're going to take a province or not. So Przemysl, I don't know, I, I don't know if, I know it's right. if it falls, uh, if the Ottomans take it, I am not going to be happy. Because look at this. It opens the border right. Like, look at it. This is good. There's a fort in the steps. That's brilliant. God, that's so many provinces to connect. Oh my god. Come on, one more month and we can deal with these. So, boom. Tech difference should be keeping us safe. Bro no, 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 no. I mean, to be fair, I don't truly care. Let's get him. Yeah, you did. Go towards Poznan. So, unfortunately. I've never realized that this was, um, this never became a part of Bra Brandenburg. Brandenburg apparently did not get the fired off, um, option, so that's, um, it's really fucking weird. But, okay, fine, I guess. So, we're actually making money. Not a lot of it, but... Oh shit, rising devastation in my body, piece of shit. Let me guess, Ottomans. So I might only be able to take Berlin. Well, I need to take something in this war. I don't want to take Berlin directly, I'm not looking forward to committing suicide. Figuratively. Why does that sound so wrong when I say it? Oh, so, I'm only interested in this. I want to feed these bronzes to Brandenburg and hopefully, hopefully make Brandenburg a subject. Uh, Galician troops are dead. That's good to know. <laughs> Armin is building spy network. 
I at least want Sternberg, but Berlin as well to go to Brandenburg. Yeah, no problem, you got no fucking chance. Even though military leaders fuck up. I mean, I lost more men, sure, but... Damn. This really is not going well for anyone but me. Go, Circassia, go. You can do it. I believe in you. Seriously, sieging down Krakow. You piece of conquest against Boo. Why do I have a conquest against Boo? Why? Can you please, Podolia, can. Eat Podolia to fall. Like, why would Poland guarantee Galicia? But I have to say, these are some slick borders. To be fair, Stolt st st is quite annoying. But look at it. Why is it so goddamn big? Like, right now, I have a feeling I have to take Stolt. Make a nicer board. It's really nice. So look, it goes brilliantly. Berlin is mine. Is this, um... Oh well, forest. Okay, let's get this province. I need to release some people. I need to weaken uh, um, this homeboy. I need to weaken Bohemia ASAP. Oh, look at my subjects go. You know what? Go back um, to there. Bohemia. Return cores to him. And release. But. Hold on. Let's blog off. Yeah, releasing them. I mean, I would love to release. Oh, I cannot release this guy because... Oh, boy. Yeah, I, there's no point in getting this guy out because I can't... Uh, oh, yeah, and the Ottomans will... I need to weaken him somehow, but I guess this will be enough for now. Who? How? I was there. I attacked those troops. I killed... Oh, Ottomans. I hate you. I am currently so afraid of the Ottomans, it's impossible to not convey my fear. Look at just the size of them. That's the that's pretty big. And they are going to be stable for a while. And I have no one else. Hey look, I don't even have that Oh, an Italian tech group will fall off with pips. Dude! I am a horde. I'm fucked as well. Knowledge sharing. Thirteen ducats. <laughs> um. Technically, yes, I can afford it. But spoils of war. Uh, looting foreign cities at seventeen ducats. Yeah, no, I'll be in a big deficit. You know, fuck it. I'll just n never not be at war. That seems to work for me. And he gets releasing each. I can only release Nitra. <laughs> and he's pissed. Why? Look, I'm so sorry. I really want you to win. I mean, I'm, I've weakened them quite a lot. I hope you find it good. Opole. Yes, unsiege Opole. You motherfucker. 
Unsee drop ball. Oh my god, you fucking idiot. You slithering idiot. You had one job. Oh, that's ugly. Oh. Dive yet, you move Cheng Sheng Ming Jiao. Bolivian and Polish in Krakow. Well, these ones are all dead. These ones will be dead. Do I choose what would I get? I mean, I guess this. This is off to people. I don't bloody need that one that much. This one just feels. Yeah. Yeah, let's get that one. That's it. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> nope. Village capital. I'm gonna be terrible. It's free death. Fuck it. That's what I want. Bohemia, Bohemia, minus seventeen. You bled. Who the hell it's a go his and Kaifa go before the Ottomans get it? How do I deal with these Ottomans? These Ottomans are big. Very, very big. I'm, I'm not so confident I can truly take them out. Barely enough. Why would you rise up for God's sake? And I have no cavalry, and he is not. Oh right. Oh, I can convert someone else. Probably. Bohemia says yes. So, Berlin is back. And now, I, I guess. Yo, my friend. Established tributary. I, he's in a fucking elector. I'm a fucking. But, now he does like me. That's something at least. And Galicia will no longer exist. Please. I have a diplomat to send, just go. Yeah. Now, border. Nah, nobody cares. Castile. Let's wait for the end of the. Yeah, with Castile. Oh shit, I need to get that one back. Let's wait for the end of the year. Oh, I need to. So, why does every, anyone care, really? What happens here? There is no reason to care. Oh, I can get this one. So, centralized power, core creation versus absolutism and governing capacity. Governing capacity. I'm quite literally constantly running into the edge of So, with this, Poland and Lithuania will be completely encircled. And from then on, it's just, um. slow, painful death. So let's wait for December, then we'll finish this war and. You were caught at the beginning of the war with 75. How? Like, what are you doing? 
Then <laughs> great. So Poland is not doing great. But the Ottomans are. And I'm terrified of facing these Ottomans. Okay, good. Finally. 20th of this, 25th of Gentlemen, we did it. Pilot in the vault. Oh. With that, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm, I can take tech versus. Hmm. Get this tech, because I don't really have much use for that thing. And let's uh, let's finish this one. So mass battery. Okay. Professional diplomatic corps. Let's read these. The added step is a foreboding and unforgiving place for the unprepared. We as a people are used to living in the harshest environments, and as such, our people are sturdy and have a knack for survival. We will ensure that all of our soldiers share these experiences and are thus able to survive much longer. Traditions of the Great Khan. The Great Khan made the world tremble with the fearsomeness of his horsemen and the breadth of his ambition. We must bring back these traditions so we can make the world tremble at our so we can too can make the world tremble tremble at our armies. War is harder on horses than it is on men. We need to ensure that our fearsome cavalry are, are well man maintained. We must ensure that we m have enough horses at all time to keep our armies strong and do so cheap. By preserving our ancient tradition of the hunt, we ensure that our armies are led by men who understand the use of the horse in combat. This will lead to better leadership. The tradition of conquest, conquering people can be a tricky business. Not everyone is ready for our... <laughs> Yeah, no, no, not enlightened. Um, we are quite literally doing what Doom Guy does, but in re in well, strategy game. Uh, still, we have discovered that there are easier ways than building imaginal skulls to bring people into our empire. It is something that our ancestors never learned. People forget that the conquer conquest of a uh, great Khan were as much uh, by superior logistics as by military strength. We must emulate the techniques of the Great Khan while making them current with the times. Uh, this will give us greater scope for conquests. And one, let it be known that boy cannot be a man unless he has rode first with our invincible host. That he can take no wife until he has. I don't. I don't want to finish this one. This fucked up. Okay. It's not brilliant, but it's not bad. Not bad at all. A impact, years of separatism. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. This is the best one in this whole. The, the traditions and the. Well, what's it? The traditional conquest. These are the best ones. And I've been thinking. Okay. My options are simple. Mughals, Ilkhanate, if I want to go Mongol Horde, or well, cheat and do, um, uh, you want. Then we get a free policy, which is not really great, but, yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching, and see you all next time. Bye-bye.